welcome back to my channel and welcome back to my bathroom every time i film in here you guys already know a skincare video is coming and today is no different as you can see from the title today i'm going to be sharing my affordable favorite skincare products and this video took me a minute oh my gosh a minute to get up but you know what when it comes to skincare products i really like to thoroughly try them out let you guys know my thoughts and that takes a lot of time so thank you so much for your patience but i'm so excited to share these products with you guys i don't think i've talked about i don't think i've talked about really actually i've talked about two of these products in the past um everything else is brand new which is also really exciting because i really want to try a new set of products to share with you guys and everything in today's video is going to be priced under 25 dollars, which in my opinion is a very fair price point for high quality affordable skincare products I will say actually majority of the products I'm sharing today are priced under $15 I gave myself that $25 price point because I'm gonna be sharing some serums that are priced a little bit higher and I definitely think that everything I'm gonna be sharing today is so worth the money okay so we're just gonna go ahead and get started and what I always like to do you guys already know this about me but I always have to just put my hair up in a high ponytail like this and away from my face anytime i'm doing my makeup my hair just has to be away from my face because i just want to work on my skin and just see skin and not really let any of my hair get in my way now believe it or not i actually don't have a cool new cleansing oil to share with you guys so i'm gonna go ahead and remove my makeup not deep clean my skin just to remove my makeup off camera and i'm definitely gonna be trying out a new cleansing oil for my next video because i'm like wait why don't i have one to share today anyway i don't i'm gonna come back remove my makeup and then we'll get started with my new affordable skincare pack. now we're gonna get started with deep cleansing my skin and i'm just gonna quickly wash my face not wash my face just like wet my face a little bit um, because you guys know i like to demonstrate all the products for you guys talk about the textures and all of that all right, so the first product is the Neutrogena Ultra Gentle Hydrating Cleanser, and this is the Creamy Formula. I wanna highlight the Creamy Formula because they also have like a foam formula, but we are gonna be talking about the Creamy Formula that I love for my skin. Now, as you apply it and you can see on my skin, this is not one of those cleansers that's gonna lather up a whole lot, which I don't mind at all. This is so hydrating on the skin as the name suggests. It really does a great job at also deep cleaning your skin and it's just so gentle as i wash my face or after i wash my face my face never feels like stripped or anything like that it just feels very hydrated and very very soft as well which i love so this has been like my go-to cleanser i'm gonna go ahead and just quickly wash my face with some warm water and then we'll come back and i'll show you guys my next few favorite products now moving on to toners and i actually have two to share with you guys today and here they are i will be demonstrating this one but i will talk about this one really quick so this right here is the glossy solution exfoliating skin perfecter this is kind of a long name so just bear with me here it's 10 percent aja bha pha salicylic acid acne treatment and this has been great for me on those days when i just feel like my skin just feels so congested or i feel like some breakouts are coming out or I am actually in fact breaking out, I will use this toner. It's really great at exfoliating your skin, but in a very gentle way, and I really like it. This is definitely not a toner that I would recommend to use every single day. I would use it as you need it. Like I said, for me, this is my go-to whenever I'm like breaking out or my skin feels congested, this is what I use. But in terms of like my everyday toner, this is the one that I'm loving, and oh my gosh, can you guys see how much I've used? I have like just like that much left, so this is from Versed, which you guys already know, one of my favorite affordable brands. I've talked about them since they launched. I just really stand behind their products because they're just simple, clean products that work. Anyway, let me tell you guys about this toner. So this is the Versed Baby Cheeks All-in-One Hydrating Milk Coconut Water and Bamboo Extract Toner. It's kind of like this milky texture, and this is so hydrating on the skin like unlike other toners you know that really kind of dry your skin as you apply it on the face and your face just feels so tight this actually has so much hydration back on your skin so the way that i like to use it is just i'll get it on the cotton pad directly from the actual bottle and then i will just apply this all over my face and normally now with toners i only like to use them at night 
because you know I like to kind of really do my all-out skincare routine at night but this toner is so gentle and so hydrating that sometimes after I work out and I just need to like quickly refresh my face I'll use this even in the daytime this is just a great all-around toner that will remove any leftover traces of makeup while also balancing out your pH levels of your skin and adding a burst of hydration on your skin. Now moving on to serums and bam, we have three serums to share today. What? I'm actually so excited because I really like all three of these serums and I use them kind of like in different ways. Anyway, I'll talk about them. I'm only gonna be demonstrating one though. And I'll start with the one I'm gonna be demonstrating and it is the Bliss Glow and Hydrate Niacinamide. I always struggle to say that word. Um, and Hyaluronic Acid Serum. And here is what it looks like. This is actually a product that I used when it first launched and then I forgot about it and I started using it again recently. And I really, really like it. So I wanna show you guys what it looks like. It has kind of like this gel consistency um, and when you apply it on the skin, it just feels so plumping and hydrating because of the niacinamide as well as the hyaluronic acid. Now you guys might be wondering, well, what are those ingredients? Why do I need them? Why do I care? So hyaluronic acid is going to really hydrate your skin, especially if you are someone like me where you have such dry skin that's always looking for hydration and moisture, you're gonna fall in love with this um, ingredient. It's a great ingredient to really add a lot of hydration on your face. Um, and niacinamide has a ton of different benefits. It helps with enlarged pores, to even out your skin, to brighten up your skin. It's just a great ingredient that I actually really wanted to start to incorporate into my skincare routine in 2020. And I'm so glad to be doing that product that I don't wanna try out right now because I actually used this yesterday and I'm really trying to space out uh, my retinol products is the Versed Pressed Restart Gentle Retinol Serum. Now, I, again, going back to what I said about Versed, I really love this brand. And if you are someone that's like new to retinol and you wanna try it out, but you're scared or you had a bad experience like me in the past and you're just like terrified, I would really recommend this retinol serum from Versed because it is so gentle. So I wanna show you guys what it looks like on the back of my hand. It's just like light green color. I'm using this now consistently um, since this actually launched and I really like it on my skin. It has not broken me out. It's so gentle, um, doesn't feel heavy. It's not really there to kind of deliver a lot of hydration or anything. It's just retinol, which is a great anti-aging ingredient. But what I love about it and I wanna emphasize about is that it is so gentle. For me, it has not broken me out. I was reading a few reviews on this as well and people really have great things to say about it. So if you are a beginner into retinol, you wanna to start to incorporate it, you don't know where to start, I would start here. The serum is this baby right here. This is the Derma E Overnight Peel AHA Exfoliant Facial. And let me just say, me personally, I don't like overnight exfoliants at all. Like. Uh, in the serum form, I just feel like, oh my gosh, is it gonna break me out overnight? Am I gonna have a weird reaction when I'm sleeping? You know, I just don't. I normally don't, but I have found a few that I really, really like, and this being one of them. Actually, really reminds me of one of my other favorite overnight exfoliants, and that is the Honeymoon Glow from Pharmacy. I feel like so many people love this. This, you definitely feel like this tingling sensation when you apply it and it is kind of a little bit more intense, whereas one from Derma E is so gentle on the skin. I'll show you guys what it looks like. It's a very light texture, like very light consistency. Um, again, it's not really gonna give you a ton of like hydration or anything like that. It feels nice on the skin, you know? But what happens with this is that when you wake up the next day, your skin is so glowing, like visibly glowing. And you can even see it on the back of my hand right now. And, um, you know, it's just gonna help to even out and exfoliate your skin very gently as you sleep. But let's talk about this. I'm actually not gonna be demonstrating this today because of course it's evening time. I'm just gonna be going to bed soon. But I have to share this because I am obsessed with it. This is again from Versed. Oh my gosh, you guys, the hype is real. I'm not gonna keep going on and on about this brand, but I have to share this because this is a new, the newest product that I've discovered from the brand and I've just, I'm obsessed with it. So this is the Versed Guards Up Daily Mineral Sunscreen, and this is SPF 35. Now, when it comes to mineral SPF, and it's funny because I'm actually currently working on a blog post, 
and I'm trying out a bunch of different mineral SPFs. I'm like writing down my thoughts every single day that I use them. A lot of them I've used now for a while and I've already made up my thoughts. A lot of time, a lot of them I'm like trying for the first time. Anyway, point is that what I have noticed with majority of the ones that I'm testing out is that it always leaves behind this like white cast. It's not even really like a white cast. It's more of like this like grayish purplish cast that is so visible and just like not flattering on your skin at all. Um, and even as you blend it in, it like doesn't blend away. Wow, Verse created an amazing mineral SPF that is completely clear. So you guys can see when you first apply it on your skin, it has this like um, tan color and this is what it looks like. And then you just keep on blending it and it completely disappears. First of all, this has such a lightweight consistency unlike other sunscreens that feel so thick and goopy. This is so so lightweight and look at that this completely disappeared i have to say i think in terms of mineral spf this is probably of the best ones that i've tried ever which is amazing my next favorite product i've actually only been using now for a week but i really like it and it's funny because i tried a few other products from this collection and i did not like those but this i really like and i am talking about the pixie retinol eye cream it comes with this like squeezy tube you can use it directly from like the applicator underneath your eyes but for me i'm just like i just like to go in and apply it on my finger and then apply it underneath my eyes and very gently i know this probably doesn't look very gentle on camera but very gently just like massage this underneath my eyes and on top of my eyelids as well now this is really soothing as the name suggests it feels really cooling like the temperature feels really nice and cooling um it's supposed to help with puffy eyes it's supposed to be anti-aging i'm not sure about all of that because i just started using it but i will say that i do like this as my night tank cream right before i go to bed Okay, next up is a face cream and I am using the Clean Beauty Lavender Chamomile Night Cream and this is what it looks like. Now this has like a gel type consistency. I would say it's like a hybrid of gel and cream and I did not think that this was honestly going to be enough hydration for my skin because of my very dry skin. But I will say that it actually is pretty hydrating. I really also like this brand. Everything is priced under $10. This cream specifically does not feel heavy on the skin whatsoever, but still delivers a ton of hydration, which you guys already know I'm so here for with my very dry skin. I will also say, if you even if you have like normal combo skin or even like oily skin, I think you actually might really enjoy this because like I said, it doesn't feel heavy or anything like that on the skin at all. It just feels like a nice burst of hydration that i'm really really liking all right guys my camera actually died so i had to take a little bit of a break but i'm back to share my last two products with you and i actually also just realized that the next product that i'm going to talk about is priced a little bit more than 25 dollars. i honestly thought that this was 24.95 but it's actually 27.95 but I feel like I should still mention it because I really think you guys are going to love this. A few of you guys have mentioned this brand to me. I just feel like I should mention it. And I am talking about the May Love Pure Marula Oil. As I mentioned, I have really dry skin. So I love using face oils at night um, on most days. But I don't like anything that feels too heavy on the skin. Anything that's going to clog my pores, break me out. I always try to stay away from it. And this, oh my gosh, my skin just loves it. And look at this like i know right now i'm like looking so oily but i'll tell you what in just a few minutes my skin will just absorb this and it just feels so plump the next day it really really just feels so plump and hydrated and nourished and all of that now for a lip mask because of course we cannot forget to take care of our lips i know for me my lips get so dry all year round so i love keeping a few different like lip masks right by my nightstand so at night I can just apply them and go to bed right now I'm using the sweet chef this one right here as well as the fresh rose one on rotation and I really enjoy both of them so here's what the sweet chef one looks like it doesn't even look like I made a dent in this you guys what the heck but let me tell you I've been using this like so much recently you only need a tiny little bit of product 
This is gonna last you forever, seriously. It's gonna last you a long time, even if you use it every single day. This is like that Laneige product, you know, the Laneige sleeping mask? No matter how much you use it, you never can make a dent. Well, this is exactly the same thing. All right, guys, that is it for my skincare routine. I feel like I didn't talk about any like facial rollers today. Actually, you know what? How can I forget? Let me get one. I'll be right back. How can I forget about this? Oh my gosh, be right back. So this was definitely not going to be part of my video, but I have to mention this ice roller. This is from Amazon. I've had this for a minute now. This is like one of the products that i bought a while back but i love it i don't use it every day just because it's not like in my bathroom because you do have to put this in your freezer if you want like the full benefits of it um but when i do use it oh my gosh <laughs> my skin loves it it's so cold right now but it feels so relaxing especially for me around like my jaw because i clench my teeth a lot it feels so relaxing oh my gosh you can even go like really close to under the eyes. Feels so nice. Oh, I love this. I'll link this below for you guys along with everything else. And I definitely recommend all the products that I mentioned in today's video. And I hope you guys enjoyed it. I'm also going to do my best to be uploading all of these products on my blog as well. So you guys have like a centralized space to refer back to. Um, I will link that below as well. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you all enjoyed this video and I will talk to you guys in my next one. Bye.